I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw vegetables that are really fruit. I come over here on the left hand side and right about here I put a dot and from that dot I draw a curve line up, down, and stop. Come back to the dot, draw another curve line out, down, and connect. Right here where the dot was we're just going to draw a slightly curved line up, curve line down. And our first vegetable that people think is a vegetable is really a fruit is a tomato. Right next to the uh, word we're going to put a dot and we're just going to draw curve line up, curve line down, connect, and we're going to mimic the line again. Curve line up, curve line down, over, up, connect. Inside, we're just going to draw a bunch of baby, baby, baby circles to fill it up. Okay? Now we come down, we put a dot, and from that dot we draw a big curve line down, in, and leave it floating. Come back to the dot, big curve line out, in, connect. Come up to the top. We're going to draw a straight diagonal up, straight line over, straight diagonal down. Inside the space we draw a curve line, curve line, curve line, curve line, curve line, connect. This is a pumpkin. And a pumpkin, if you slice it, you end up with a curve line up, curve line down, connect, and on the top part we're going to put a lot of little baby circles. And I'll tell you about these baby circles because that's the whole key to these vegetables that are really fruit. Now I come down again and I put a dot over here on the left and I draw a big curve line up, over, down, around, and connect. And I put some dot, 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 dot. And this is a cucumber. And if you slice a cucumber, put a dot, you'll get a round circle. Mimic the line again inside, put a dot, little circle. And inside that we put our little baby circles cucumber. Now come down again, put a dot, and we're going to draw a curve line out, curve line in, out, and up. Leave it floating. Come back to the dot, curve line out, in, out, connect. Come up to the top, put a little curve line, and now put straight diagonal up, straight diagonal over, connect. Inside, we're just going to draw some curved lines, curved lines, curved lines. And this is a pepper. Okay? And if you slice the top of the pepper, you get a curved line, little curved line on the right, little curved line on the left, curved line connect, come up to the top, put a little curved line, straight diagonal up, over, straight diagonal down. Underneath we put all those little baby circles. Keep going, keep going. Okay? Come straight down, put a dot. Curve line, curve line out, come back to the dot, curve line, curve line down, connect. Couple of dots, dot, 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 dot. And this is an avocado. And if you slice an avocado in half, you get this. Put a dot, curve line, curve line, come back to the dot, curve line, curve line, connect, 
right here, put an oval, and now skinny mini, draw the outside line again. Okay, vegetables that are really fruits. And why do we say that? If it's a fruit, it has its seeds inside. So here are the inside seeds of a tomato, seeds of a pumpkin, little inside seeds of a cucumber, seeds um, for a pepper, and one giant seed for an avocado. Okay, let's see how we're gonna color these in. Okay, the first thing I'm gonna do is color my tomato red. Tomatoes come in all different colors, but most common is red. And on my tomato slice, I'm gonna color my outside inside part red. We're gonna add a little green top. And for my seeds, I'm gonna make those yellow. Now, I come down to my pumpkin, make my top green, get my orange, color it all orange, come over to my slice, and I color this section orange, but I leave my pumpkin seeds white, okay? Come down to my cucumber, color it green, And I'm just going to put a rim of green around the outside. And cucumbers, when you cut them, have those little seeds inside. I'm going to leave those white also. Come to my pepper. Color it red. And the interesting thing about peppers, it's all the peppers. It's red peppers, it's bell peppers. Because all of them, here's the green and the green have this little cap, when you cut it, has all the seeds. And they're white also, so I'm gonna leave those alone. Last, my avocado. I'm gonna double color this, so I'm gonna make it green first, and then lightly, not too dark, I'm gonna put some black on top, not too dark. Now, I come over to the inside, and I color in green, I'm going to color in my seed brown and I'm just going to outline the edge. Okay, let's see what these look like all colored in. Okay, here are my vegetables that are really fruits all colored in. And remember, if they have seeds on the inside, they're really a fruit. Okay, bye bye.